Hello, hello, dear viewers. Welcome to our channel. It's very good to have you here. In this video, we are going to assemble a differential out of these components, a teaching model differential out of these components. And in the meantime, you will understand how the differential is assembled, how it is put together, and how it operates. Let's begin. Well, this is going to be the ring gear. This is going to be the ring gear. Let's put together the ring gear. Let this be one side gear. So let's say this is one side gear. So this will be a side gear, one side gear. And then in order to have uh, a drive for the pinion, let's install this. This is going to be a drive for the sun gear or the pinion gears. This should be one sun gear. It will be inserted in such a manner. And we have a shaft. This will be another pinion gear inserted in such a manner. Here we have a tiny, and then we have this member. And this is going to engage to the pinion, to the drive pinion. This actually comes from the transmission output shaft. So this will be the input for the differential. Let's put it in here. Let's put this differential in here. And we have this assembly here.
So one half of the differential is done.
So this is a simple differential assembly for a teaching model. When we look at the operation here, we have the input to the differential. This is a pinion shaft that is coming from the propeller shaft on a vehicle. For this particular case, this one will be the drive pinion. This will be the ring gear that will be in total mesh with the pinion and power flow. Power from the pinion will drive the ring gear and from the ring gear it goes to the planetary gear shaft. This is small shafts. It will come to the planetary shaft from the planetary gear shaft or from the pinion shaft right here. It comes to the pinion gears. From the pinion gears it comes to the side gears and finally it goes out to the axle. So this is how this differential is assembled and this is how it operates. So the differential will allow the left and right wheel to be driven at different speed. It will change the direction of power flow. Here it is turning in such a manner, but when it comes to the wheels, it is turned by 90 degree. It will multiply it work by reducing gear. Here we have small number of these compared to the ring gear. So it will reduce the speed and multiply it work. And it will also split this one power to the left and right wheel. So this is the function of the. Well, I hope you have found this video very interesting. If you liked this video, please smash the like button. If you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification so that you will be notified whenever we come up with another video. Till then, stay safe.